Welcome back to Mass Effect. I'm recording this. The Varens is the food supply. Damn it! Elizabeth. I'm so sorry. I thought you were Geth or one of those Varen. You're safe now. But why were you here in the first place? It's my own fault. Everyone else was running, and I stayed to back up data. Next thing I knew, the Geth ship latched on, and the power went out. I was trapped. I, I tried to get out, but the way was blocked. We'll get you out, as soon as we find out what the Geth are after. It's not the Geth. It's the energy field they put up. They don't want anyone else getting access to the... I'm here for the Geth. It's very important I find out what they're after. I don't know for certain, but... I'm guessing they're here for the Thorian. Thorian? What is that exactly? It's an indigenous life form. Exogeny was studying it. What else can you tell me? Do you know where I can find this Thorian? I... I might be able to, but not with those Geth crawling around everywhere. Look, we need to get out of here, past that field. You know how we can shut it down? No, Oops. not exactly. But I think the Geth ship is powering it. I've noticed the Geth laying power cables everywhere. You could follow those cables, but there's Geth all over the place. All right. I'll look into it. Stay put until the field is down. Yeah, you don't have to tell me twice. I'll just find a small hole to hide in until the field is down. Oh, here, take my ID. This should get you past any locked doors. Good luck with that field. Ah. Fucking hell. One of them killing bees, it gives you hope. It gives you hope, a um, food supply. Was this it? Because I could have sworn there's like an alpha varan you gotta kill and then they come and scoop up what's left and eat it. Supervisor. Damn it! Tell me what I want or I'll blast your virtual ass into actual dust! Please contact your supervisor for a level 4 security exemption or make an appointment with. Stupid machine! If there is nothing else, please step aside. There is a queue forming behind you for the use of this console. Ah. Wow. You died very easily. Exogeny Corporation reminds all staff that the discharging of weapons while on company property is strictly forbidden. Welcome back, Research Assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? What information was the last user attempting to access? Fetching data. The previous user was attempting to access details on the study of Subject Species 37, the Thorian. Tell me everything you told the Krogan. I was unable to provide the previous user with any relevant data. Aside from lacking proper access, there has been no new data available on Species 37. All sensors monitoring the observation post at Zoo's Hope have been inactive for several cycles. What does Zoo's Hope have to do with the Thorian? Species 37 is located within the substructure of the Zoo's Hope outpost. Tell me everything you know about the Thorian. The Thorian is a simple plant life form that exhibits a sentient behavior uncommon with other flora. Through dispersion and the eventual inhalation of spores, it can affect and control other organisms, including humans. The Zoo's Hope Control Group has yielded interesting results. Before sensors went offline, almost 85% of all test subjects were infected. Are you saying Exogeny knew its people were getting infected? It was deemed necessary to assess the true potential of Species 37. No wonder they were behaving so strangely. Your pilot should be warned. Joker! Come in, Joker! Damn it! That field's blocking us. We need to drop that field and get back to Zeus' home. VI, what can you tell me about the Geth ship and the field it's generating? I have limited data on the Geth. They have effectively blocked all sensors within the facility. I have detected unusual power fluctuations, but am unable to determine the source. 
We need to find that ship. Let's get moving. Going to standby mode. So I do wonder. Hmm. I do wonder if maybe the um the Leviathans got their ability to indoctrinate from the Forian, and then the Reapers got their ability to indoctrinate from the um Leviathan. Like, maybe, who knows how long the Forian's been around for. Would be really interesting to find that, that like the Forian's like one of the first, like original species. Where do I go again? Over here? Yes, up there. Wait, that's a one-way drop, right. Where do I go up again? Wasn't over there. Fuck. <laughs> that's literally the only way you can go. Am I just an idiot? It's possible. And very likely. It would actually make sense that you have to go through here because you have to talk to this VI in order to find out about the Forian. I think I was just wasn't looking properly. No. Ah. Deceiving. Looking at it like that, you just wouldn't think. <laughs> I am an idiot. Geff. Die, please. Thank you. These ones are the heretics. Whoa. Dude, stay out of the sun. That's too tan. Way too tan. Die please, die please, die please, die please. Thank you. No, 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 no. Fuck you. Oh, I hate these fucking jumpy things. I'm really glad they removed them, because they're just insane. That would have been nice in that one. These beds of the Krogan because they do not seem strong enough. Okay, which way do I fucking go now? It's that thing. No, Jesus Christ. God, I hate the maps too. They're just bad. Okay, so I came in through here. Yes. 
there. Like, I love the story, but the level design in the first one, it was terrible. It just was. Most of the levels were exactly the same, or at least very similar layouts. Squad mates, get in your fucking way of firing, you take cover too easily. Great story, terrible combat. Gif consoles are. Uh... Or not, I thought I saw a pop up. Where the flying fuck do I go? Here? Ah, that's what I was saying. Those ones just aren't interested in the gunfire they heard before. Like, oh, I wonder what that was. Especially since the Gep are like a hive mind, wouldn't they have known their people? All the other ones just got gunned down. Oh. Doesn't matter. You dead. Good. This is interesting, Commander Shepard. A containment lab of some kind. It may be help. If we can dislodge even one claw, the ship may fall. Uh thirty-one, thirty-four. How the fuck do I do this again? Look at that, first try. Oh, I know how to do math. I seem to remember that being a lot harder in the original trilogy too. Like it was different somehow. I think. Boom. Boom? Very good. Oh, no boom. The exit will be down. Now we can go deal with the story and creature. I hope that ship was full of those Geth bastards. Keep your guard up. There still might be a few Geth inside the base. I repeat, Normandy to shore party. Are you reading? Anyone there? Normandy to shore party. Come on, Commander. Talk to me. Is that you, Joker? What's going on over there? We're in lockdown here, Commander. Something happened to the colonists. They're banging on the hull, trying to claw their way inside the ship. They're freaking out. They can't do any real damage. We're on our way back. Just hold your position. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, we'll just wait right here for you, Commander. This place will be crawling with Geth in a minute. Keep together and we'll get out of here in one piece. Love Tali just being... I hope they're all dead. That will make sense, knowing the history of the... Quarians and the Geth. Now, which way do I go? Some the lighting is just terrible. What was that over there? Uh, nothing really massively important, I doubt. Yeah, like level design, not the greatest.
Not the best level design. Probably Mass Effect 2. Like, um... Oh, what was that? Asari place. Can't remember the name of it. The one where you find Liara again. That was a cool world. Especially when you can just throw that dude out of the window. <laughs> that was funny. No, not there. Fuck's sake. This is what I mean about the level design. There's no clear path. You run fucking slow. There. Dumbass. Really struggling to find things to talk about. <laughs> Where the fuck? I could have sworn you were in there. Do you not go in there? There. You fucking idiot. There you are. We should get out of here. I don't think this place is safe. I need some answers. You knew more about the Thorian than you let on. I... I was afraid. I wanted to stop the tests, but they threatened me. Told me I'd be next. When the Geth attacked, I stayed behind to send a message to Colonial Affairs. I tried to tell them where to find the Thorian, but the power cut before I could send the message. I... I never meant for this to happen. You did what you could. I'll help them, if you can tell me where to find the Thorian. The Thorian is underneath Zoo's Hope, but the entrance is blocked. The colonists covered it with the freighter just before the Geth attacked. But why are the Geth after the Thorian? What could Saren want with it? Well, it does have unique mind control capabilities. That's what Exogeny was interested in. Normandy to shore party, come in. What is it, Joker? We're getting a lot of Geth comm chatter. Looks like they're headed your way. Thanks for the heads up, Joker. You heard the man. Let's move out. I'm coming with you. I might be able to help. Undo the mess I helped create. Where is she? Did she just fucking teleport? Yeah, so now we drive back, right? Oh, I believe so. Yeah, we're meant to go back here. No, oh, fuck. Fuck. Shit. And we can tell the people down that other pathway. And they give us those grenades to take them out non-lethally. Which I am going to do. Because it gives me some decent war assets for Mass Effect 3. You fuck off, mate. Jesus. Yeah, you know, like this here, this drive back and then back again, you can clearly tell that we're just trying to stretch the game out a bit longer. Oh, fuck. That's why I wonder if they made the Mako bad on purpose, so you'd have to... So it would stretch the game out even longer. You just take her out. You can't do this, John. Everyone, shut up. Uh, let me think. 
What's going on? You won't get away with this. Get her out of here! Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Lisbeth! Damn it! Come, come out where I can see you! All of you! <sighs> Shepard, damn it. I knew it was too much to hope the Geth would kill you. I found some interesting facts about you in the Exogeny database. I know what you did during the Blitz, but your heroics aren't needed here. Not this time, Jean. You need to back down and let them go. You, you don't understand. It's not that easy. Communications are back up. Exogeny wants this place purged. This is a human colony, Jong. You can't just repurpose us. It's not just you. There's something here far more valuable than a few colonists. Are you gonna tell them about the Thorian? Or should I? The what? It's a telepathic life form living under Zeus Hope. It's taking control of the colonists there. Exogeny knew all along. You won't get away with this, Jong. So you keep saying, but nobody's gonna miss a few colonists. Can't you see the inherent potential in this colony? Think of the promotional opportunities. Opportunities? What the hell are you talking about? They recovered from an alien attack on a frontier world. Add that to your company profile. Well, yeah. No one's ever gone broke playing the champion of humanity card. Sadly, you'd probably make a killing. But if it will let us get back to our lives, I'm for it. It just might work. Wait, no, but the infected colonists will throw a bit of a wrench in that plan. No, no, they need to disappear. You can't just kill the colonists. It's not their fault. If you kill only the Thorian, it might be enough to stop the infection. Maybe. It's worth a try, but I don't know if I can avoid harming the colonists. There has to be another way. Maybe there is. Come and talk to me before you leave, Commander. Just make sure there's no evidence when you're done. I'm glad you've decided to help us. I think there's a way to avoid killing the colonists. What did you have in mind? I think you could safely use a nerve agent to neutralize the colonists. Like a gas grenade. Sounds good. I'll do what I can. Excellent. Thank you so much, Commander. Yeah, from having those guys, it actually gives you a decent amount of war assets. Because they're immune to the... Indoctrination. This guy. Any luck finding my workstation out in the ruins? I managed to find the data and transfer it to your OSD. That's very good news indeed, thank you. I was there anyway. It was the least I could do. Well, I appreciate it. Here, you certainly earned this. Thanks again, Commander. Zero credits? Fuck you. Um, this way. Yeah, like... Yeah, you get definitely war assets for Pharos, but I think you need to do all the, um, side quest things. Like, I've improved their water, but I also need to do their power and the food, which I think is back there, but I'll do it later. Off camera. Because it's boring as hell. Die. Oop. <laughs> but taking these out is so easily because you can do that. But aiming is ridiculously hard. That was bullet sponges. Or rocket sponges, whatever. These things. Super creepy. Blech. What was that creature? It certainly wasn't human. No hitting the colonists, even if the Thorian makes them fire on us. That's what the gas grenades are for. Very well, Commander. Let's go. 
Okay, um, it's a bit shorter, but I'm gonna end this recording here because I'm really hungry. Anyway, thank you for watching this episode. If you liked it, please like, share, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Apologies for the lack of decent content in here, but it gets interesting soon. Anyway, I will see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching.